On March 16, NCRTC unveiled the modern and commuter-centric interiors of India's first regional rail at its Duhai depot in Ghazibagh. RRTS or Regional Rapid Transit System is a dedicated high-speed, high-capacity, comfortable computer service connecting regional centers. It is different from conventional railways as it provides high-frequency point-to-point regional travel at a high speed along a dedicated pathway. This year, National Capital Region Transport Corporation under the Urban Development Ministry will begin trial runs on the priority section of Delhi Ghazibagh Merit RRTS corridor. The Delhi Ghazibagh Merit corridor is expected to have a daily ridership of around 8 lakh passengers. The corporation is currently working on the priority corridor which is between Saibabad and Dubai. This is 17 km long corridor which is expected to be operational by the end of 2023. But the uh, 82 km long for Delhi Merit corridor is expected to be begin operation by 2025, which will three years from now. Since it is called a high speed uh, rail corridor, so the speed can touch up to 180 km per hour, which will ensure the journey between Delhi to Merit can be covered within an hour. The approximate journey, journey time is about 55 minutes. There will be less stoppage than there are in the, in the metro train. And uh, usually the journey by road for, between Delhi and Merit takes two to three hours. So the commuters living in Merit can reach Delhi within an hour, which is one of the major benefit of this corridor. They'll have to keep it affordable because uh, the kind of people will, uh, who will travel in the segment will be of mid-income mid, mid group. So uh, it will not be on the higher side, but at the same time, they have to keep it to ensure the basic amenities provided uh, during the ride matches the passenger also. Since the clientele will be slightly different than the road, it will be most of the corporate people who are coming, who are living in Meerut or any of the nearby stations will come to Delhi. The, interestingly, the uh, corridor is connecting Delhi in Sarai Kalikana, where which is a transit hub of Delhi. I mean, you can go anywhere from there. So in between also there are stoppages like in Ghaziabad and near Greater Noida. So all the uh, corporate population living along the route will use this uh, mode of transport to reach the center of Delhi and, to, and go from there. The train is also connecting some railway station in between. If anyone has to go to railway station or airport, because from Sarai Kalika, you can go to the airport as well. So this uh, this train will cater to mix of the population. I think it will be a mix of what you get in the metro train and in a Shabdi train of Indian Railway. So uh, there will be luggage racks to keep the luggage because since it's a long distance train and uh, there will be Wi-Fi to cater to the daily need of the passenger, by their charging facility at every seat. It, they are expecting to preserve a coach for women also, for the safety of women travellers. Also, uh, I think uh, there will be wheelchair facility at, the, at every station for the differently abled passengers. Uh, the seating is also expected to be different uh, so that the 55 minute journey Will, uh, remains comfortable for the traveler. Also, the corporation is planning a different uh, coach for premium segment, fare for which will be on the higher mm-hmm. side, but it will, be, it will be like a first class of an airline. It is a separate entity which comes under the housing ministry. However, they work closely with the Delhi Metro. Uh, the NCRTC has planned, uh, initially has planned three corridors of which Delhi Merit is under construction. The other two corridors are Delhi Alwar and Delhi Panipat. So interestingly, all these three corridors will merge at Sarai Kalika, which will become a transit hub for Delhi. And the three corridors together will uh, intersect with seven metro stations. So, so that that interchange becomes easier and people coming from anywhere can board uh, Metro or the RRTS sector. The Delhi Alwar uh, segment will also cater to the people going to Gurgaon because it will go to airport, then Gurgaon and then to Alwar. 
Similarly, the Delhi Panipat corridor will cover the north part of Delhi. However, uh, it is uh, the NCRTC is uh, still working with the state government to finalize the route and all, but uh, they are hopeful of uh, starting the construction work within two years. The corporation is working hard to start the operation uh, uh, by mid 2023, and they will start the trial and also the. Uh, this year. If everything goes well, the priority section should commence uh, by the end of 2023 and when the common public can go and travel. The, the Merit Delhi section is 82 km long, of which 17 km between Saibabad and Duhai is priority section, which will be operational by the end of 2023. The entire corridor is expected by 2025, so still it will fill some time away.